You hinted at a larger scheme and said there would be a place for us in it, should we so choose. I did. And the offer remains open to you all. But I fear you may lack the vision to go along with me. The next stage of my plans might be considered... genocidal. What are you going to do? Destroy the world? Nothing so crude. Half. Two-thirds at the most. <laughs> it's not a joke. It's the next step in a plan to transform the planet in a manner that will render your $100 million payday both trivial and meaningless. What possible profit could there be in destroying the world? The first thing you have to understand is that I am old. Older than the human race. I know that you believe this to be true. It is true. 80,000 years ago, I was living in what is now the island of Sumatra. One night, the sky lit up with streaks of fire. Meteors. But my primitive mind thought the stars were falling from the sky. One meteor fell to earth in my valley. My compatriots ran, but it was very cold, and the glowing stone was warm. I slept there, bathed in the meteor's strange radiations. And when I awoke the next morning, I was forever changed. The radiation mutated me, evolving me, I was instantly aware of my increased intelligence. It was only with the passage of time that I discovered the rest of my gift. So far as I know, I cannot die. Is that a fact? Go ahead. Why'd you do that? Don't you realize what he's planning? In his new world, our money doesn't matter. <gasps> you are correct. Money won't matter. It's trivial in the long run. <clears throat> Let me tell you about the long run. I've lived thousands of lives. I've been a laborer, a scientist, a priest, an artist, a healer, a thief. But most often, a conqueror. I'm still not seeing how this makes up for my money. 75,000 years ago, a disaster nearly rendered humanity extinct. I enslaved the survivors and ruled with an iron hand. In a few generations, my people were well underway to repopulating the Earth and becoming the planet's dominant species. I was happy then. You're taking the world over out of nostalgia? I'm taking over because humanity is prideful and belligerent, and once again needs my guiding hand. But before I take over, I intend to soften them up. By destroying half the world. Those who survive will happily follow a leader who offers food, comfort, and order. That could work. It will work. To you, my warlords, I offer dominion over as much of what remains of the planet as each of you can hold, second only to me. Interested? You haven't left us much choice. <laughs> How do you propose to kill that many people? Even without the Justice League, they will fight. They'll lose. 